You want to take your family to a place where they can thrive and enjoy life and be part of the local community in a way that's meaningful. It's got a lot of Southern hospitality. It's got a bit of a small town feel, but there's a lot of stuff to do. Clarksville is definitely the best place to work and to live and to raise a family. You have opportunities with anything you need is, is here. It's a great place to raise your kids. It's a great place to retire. It's a great place to be. And that's our Clarksville. Our future is bright. I have never been so excited in our community with what's going on with the redevelopment downtown, with our education, with our businesses. We just have so much opportunity and so much potential for our kids, our families here, for quality of life. I mean, we've got it all right here in Montgomery County. We're the fifth largest city in Tennessee. <laughs> it's, it's a small. pretty small town. Yeah, um, yeah. That community aspect and that small town feel. I love the small town with the large opportunities. The cost of living is very doable. No matter what level you're at, you can absolutely find a safe, good community to, to establish you, yourself, your family, make great friends. There's a lot of support for new businesses, not just from the chamber, but also the community. Yeah, uh, The community yeah. really rallies around new businesses. With the new restaurants, the event center, it's incredible what's happening in downtown. It's a good place to gather, get a cup of coffee, walk around, socialize, and buy some local products. And the Chamber, the EDC, everybody's working. We all have the same focus to make Clarksville the best place it can be. We want to make sure that the other businesses in our community get that leg up, and we celebrate those businesses. We're on the top of mind when they're recruiting large industries now. They, they think Clarksville, Montgomery County, they think, hey, that's a great place to go. You're gonna love living there. You're gonna love your kids going to school there. You're gonna love that community. How many counties can actually go, oh look, we have Google, we have LG, we have Hankook. Things continue to be added to our community, which brings in more jobs and more people. And so I think with that, you see people that get out of the military, they wanna stay here, they want their kids to go to school here, they wanna have their business here, and they're investing in our community. And I think it is so important that we turn around as a community and invest in them. I love being next to a military installation. I absolutely love the heroes living next door. You have folks coming in from Fort Campbell. I think it's a great melting pot. It is uniquely different in terms of the way that the community interacts with the military, how the community supports the military. Without a doubt, Clarksville is the most patriotic, loves our military, loves our country. It's made us a more vibrant, exciting place because of the cultural diversity that comes in. You couldn't ask for a more vibrantly diverse community. And then of course you look at our school system that's so diverse. We are a phenomenal school system. I always tell people, you know, I say our future workforce is sitting in a kindergarten classroom right now. You have not only your, your grades 1 through 12, but we have some great college opportunities here with Austin P and a couple others. We have a school system that's ranked one of the top in the state. Some will go to college. We even have those trade schools so they can learn those jobs. We have this phenomenal state university right in our backyard. I, I couldn't be more proud of their growth and what they've done and the programs that they've added. There is a lot of stuff to do here that enhances why we live here. I, I firmly believe that our, our park system here is, is second to none. The number of events they put on, how well kept they are. Yeah. But not only are the parks, think about all the artwork we're adding to the downtown. You know, we have our downtown Montgomery County Museum, which is fantastic, that tells everything about this area in a historic building. And now that they've lit up the museum at nighttime, this, the roof line is just incredible. So you have all these light and artwork shows that are going on that, that just draws people to the events, and I think it's fantastic. With the FNM Bank Arena, you're going to have ice skating, ice hockey. You, you, Austin Peay's playing their games here. Aren't you excited about Austin Peay playing the ball games you, down there? You know, I, I've had my seats at the Austin Peay games forever. I can't wait to see what my new seats are going to look like. <laughs> There's Fort Defiance. There's the Cumberland River with so much history there. Walking along that, that river is a beautiful river walk. Every day is an adventure with seeing somebody you know, meeting somebody new. The community is, is fantastic and I love 
the strength of, of friendships that you form here. I remember driving uh, my family around and we were just kind of checking out the city. We pull up to this four-way stop sign and I waved at the person on the other side and he and they waved back. <laughs> so <laughs> Valerie said, my wife Valerie said, who is that? I said, don't know. But it's those kinds of things though that made it uh, joyful to be here. That is our greatest asset, is our, is our people. Their can-do attitude, their patriotic attitude, their love of the place they live. I think that's why we will continue to be successful because we have a wonderful community of people. This is home and it probably always will be and, and I'm proud of it. I'm proud to tell people I'm from Clarksville, Montgomery County, Tennessee.